Yo, what's up guys? This is Adrian Graphics. I want to guys give you guys a tour, show you what we're all about, what we do here, what my team looks like. We're going to go ahead and give you a tour inside. Let's go. All right, I am thirsty. I'm going to get some water. So welcome in guys. This is Adrian Graphics and Marketing here in Lincoln, California. You see, I got this nice little cabinet. It's got some snacks and goodies. Most of the time it's empty because we haven't been here a lot lately, but got this nice little shelf here. These are some uh, suitcases that my wife bought that were shelves that we were gonna hang up on the wall. Haven't done it yet. We're working on way more important things right now than to worry about shelves, but got a little security camera there. I got my rack for my audio for when we do our live events. This is what we use. This is a little uh, desk that we have for our lead designer sits here. Right now I have my MacBook set up here because uh, our lead designer is now working and traveling remotely. Uh, but we have a lot of our gear here. So you can see we have this little power station that's got a ridiculous amount of outlets on it and you can turn them off and on individually, which is really neat. We have our road mics. We got the GoPro camera sitting here, our camera bag. I have my Wacom Cintiq down there, just some extra cables and everything for storage, which is really nice that this has storage. It even has a little keyboard thing in here. I haven't used one of those in years, but this is our little front area. You can see Mariano over here working away on his iMac. He's got his dope speaker that's sitting over there. Got a little mini fridge, you know, our two banners that are sitting there and then our water machine, gotta have fresh water. And then if you come over this way, uh, these are some books that we're gonna ship out to students and people that are part of the Instagraphics Pro Network. So if you're not part of that, I would definitely encourage you to join that group with us. We're having a lot of fun leveling up as a community, health, wealth, relationships, doing some cool stuff there. This is one desk. This is when Ian's here in the office, he's usually working from this desk here. He took his iMac home with him. And then we have our printer. This whole little thing is a mess. This is like one of my first goals for 2022 to knock this out, get this super clean, super organized. And then we have where a lot of the magic happens or a lot of the cool stuff that we come up with that I come up with in my brain when I'm sleeping at night or early in the morning or late at night. And this is where it comes down to actually putting it on paper, if you will, or actually writing it down. And so I download my brain onto this thing and we wipe it clean and we write more again and wipe it clean and wipe more again. And it's massive and we get a lot of use out of this baby. And you can see here, we have a little bit of artwork. It's not the greatest artwork in the world. My business partner and mentor, Larry, picked that out, but I wanna actually deck it out with artwork all the way down the building for some cool shots that we've done. And then here, where I'm standing in front of, is the mecca of what you see our YouTube channel is all about. This is how our YouTube channel came to be, and it's just grown to this place. And we still have a lot of growing to do, but we have these original lights that we originally bought when I first started when I was doing video production in my other studio in Granite Bay. We got the Manfrotto 504 HD tripod. I've shown you guys that in the past in other videos. I have my brand new iMac here with this uh, Adesso webcam. This actually is a really nice webcam that Mariano brought in and I was really impressed by it. I was watching Sarah Peachy or Dici's videos and she has the Logitech 4K camera. So I wanna check out some other webcams and kind of explore some of those gadgets because I think webcams are really important in the day that we're living in with Zoom meetings and conference calls and things like that. So you gotta get a good webcam. The one that comes in the iMac is just not that great, unfortunately, but this is my desk and I love this desk. I've done videos about this desk and desks in general. And I love this desk because it goes up and down like this. I can adjust it for sitting or standing and I'm trying to get in the habit of doing more standing. It's better for you, it's better for your health, but this is just a really neat piece of equipment that I have that I've invested in. I had two of these at one time, but I ended up selling one and I'm looking for another one now. And then if you see here, we're actually just set this up today. This is really cool, but we actually mounted my A6400, which is one of our cameras, to this arm here, which is for a light originally, but now we've got it set up for the overhead shot. So when I'm doing drawing and sketches and doing more artwork, which is a big plan for me, in 2022, I want to design more. I want to draw more specifically. I really love to draw and I've lost touch with that as I've gotten more and more into my entrepreneurial journey and being a business owner. I haven't made the time. Notice how I said not finding the time. I haven't made the time to do more art. So I'm going to get into that. And because I'm going to be doing a lot of gear stuff, I'm going to be showing uh, a lot of overhead top shots from that. And then you can see here, this we put up about a few months ago, which is a really nice, these panels that you can get on Amazon really just brought the set to life, really set us up. And then I bought this light because of Andre G. He has one that's very similar, just like Graham Stephan. We just bought these GVMs. So we use a lot of really cool stuff, but lighting is really key. You can see we have a lot of lights. I got these really beautiful blue. Uh, you can change the colors. You can control them from an app. There's just so much that you can do with that. And then of course, 
This is like my little set wall here where I have all my books. I got Mr. E.T. that I got from my wife as a gift, which I love him. He's just so awesome. How cute is that guy? And then I got the design. I've actually had this thing now for, man, coming up to like 10 years, these letters here with my American flag, Go America. And then uh, just a few of my books. I probably have, you know, four or five times as many books as these at home. And then I have some artwork. Got some mushies. I love mushrooms and just the power of mushrooms. I talked about that in one of my last videos. Uh, being able to biohack. I got some art from the Disney event that I went to. Some really neat artwork. This is original artwork from an artist. Uh, I'm forgetting his name, Tim. I remember his Tim. I think it was Tim, but he works with Disney. Um, and then I got, of course, some little one. I need to take a break and I need some inspiration. I can just grab my little guitar and... Well, that couldn't have been a worse demonstration, but I know how to play. I'm not the greatest, but I actually know how to play. And so I like to keep this thing around here. I have a case for it in the back, but this is a beautiful Epiphone. One of my mentors used to have an Epiphone. So for me, it's kind of a sentimental piece and why I keep it around here at the office, just in case anybody comes in that they have the uh, hardcore rock star skills and they want to jam. And then uh, we have this massive monster of a TV that my business partner bought. Larry, it's a 70 inch Vizio smart TV. It does not get utilized as much as, much as it should. In fact, I had to turn the Wi-Fi back on to it today because we turned all the Wi-Fi devices off during our agency summit because it steals bandwidth and we needed all the bandwidth that we can get. And then uh, of course, this is my beautiful daughter. You guys have probably seen this photo in the back of almost every single one of my videos. This is another piece of original artwork by Becky. She's an amazing local artist. I love to support local artists. And then one of my favorite things that I own, period, is my hand-signed, Tony Hawk 1987. I don't remember the location of this. It's a 1987 shot of him and he hand signed this thing. It was for a fundraiser that I bought and then I matted it and framed it. It's a beautiful piece, something I'm really excited and proud to have. And then last but not least, if you flip around here, you'll see we have this green screen wall. We've used this in many videos. Uh, we don't use it as much as I thought we were going to, but we still have used it for a bunch of different Instagraphics videos, the cool backgrounds to swap those out. But this actually has the green, the white and the black. I did buy this on Amazon. I could probably put a link in the description, but if I put a link in the description, it's probably gonna be to a nicer one. This one's okay. Um, the way that these are soft, you have to iron them to keep them all smooth and it can be kind of a pain in the butt. So I would find some material that actually is like more of a plastic, kind of a PVC material that's more smooth that you don't have to do that with because this has been kind of a nightmare. This has been ironed, I don't even know how many times, or steamed multiple times. You can see it still has some wrinkles in it. But this is an important piece to any video set that you got to have. And we're using it to create content, to create educational information, whether it's info products or stuff for YouTube or stuff for our courses that are coming out. And so this is it. You've seen it. Oh, one more thing, right? Didn't take him to the throne. Got to take him to the throne. Let's go show him the throne. Pardon the mess behind the wall. Everybody always wonders what's back here, but it's an absolute mess right now. We don't even have lighting, so it's impossible to see But you can see here. The Banyo. This is where I do my best thinking. This is where we're going to end the video. But I hope you guys enjoyed checking out my office, my studio. We're actually in a retail location. Not many people get to say or do that, but we do. We're lucky enough. And this is how I started my career. And this is what I plan on always having as some sort of brick and mortar retail location. And hopefully we can develop this whole corner and turn it into a living space and all kinds of cool stuff like a youth center. So thank you guys so much for watching. I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. I'm Adrian Boysell, and as always, keep looking up.